All right, ladies and gentlemen, today is the long awaited operator tier list. I know you guys have been asking for this one down in the comments, so here it is. Make sure you guys like the video, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. But listen, let's get straight into this, right? No wasting time, no wasting time. Let's go with Sledge, all right? I mean, you guys know I like Sledge, right? He's pretty good. I mean, they slowed him down a lot. I think they're actually bringing Sledge back to a two speed. Let me know down in the comments if that's true. I saw patch notes that Sledge goes back to a two speed. Let me know. I'm not actually sure. You know, Sledge, though, let's put him in E tier. He's really not that good anymore. I mean, he's like okay, but like, you know. Thatcher, I mean, with the with the secondary EMP grenades, guys, do we even need Thatcher? I don't even see people ban Thatcher anymore. Honestly, like, do we need Thatcher, bro? All the way to F tier. Let's be honest, guys. Let's be honest, guys. All the way to F tier. Come on now. Mute. Now that that's another operator they made one speed, bro. Why why did they mute why did they make mute a one speed? I just don't even get that. Why are they making all the operators one speed, bro? Mute used to be good. They nerfed him. His mute jammers don't go as high. They don't go as wide, right? The radius sucks now. He's a one speed. But he's still got the shock on the SMG. He's got the C4. Yeah, we'll give him D tier. Okay, well, we'll, let's, let's start filling out the tiers here. Thermite, I mean, bro, really, who even needs to open walls? I mean, honestly, I just Ash rush in or like Amara rush in. So I'm going to put Thermite probably in like C tier. I mean, he's okay. But, you know, like, why would I even get the wall open when I could play Amaru and Amaru straight into the site, right? Amaru's S tier, clearly. Got the G8. You've got the shotgun. You've got the SMG 11. Who, need, who needs a wall? Why do we need to open up the wall? Amaru straight into the site. Who cares? Ash, same thing. I don't need to be opening up reinforced walls all the way to S tier, bro. Ash charged the door, walk in sight. I cleared out the whole round in 30 seconds, right? Now let's see Pulse. Okay. Pulse is, uh, you know, he's all right. He's not as good as he used to be back in the Sergio days, but uh, you know, we'll give him an E tier. Okay. I think that's fine. Castle, they did buff him. He's got the four barricades now. We do love Castle, but you know, we're going to put him in E tier as well. It kind of sucks. Montaigne, you know, I think... Honestly, bro, Montaigne's S tier. You guys just don't know how to play him. I'm going to be honest. You guys just have no idea how to play Montaigne. He's actually the GOAT. Twitch, though, mm, everybody, likes the, everybody likes the F2, but, you know, F2, F tier, same thing. Let's see. Doc. Okay, we're going to put Doc. Hmm. Yeah, Doc's S tier, guys. Come on, MP5. But Rook is all the way in F tier. Hold on. Let me explain this. You guys are like, wait a minute, wait a minute. Why? Why? What's the difference? Well, bro, everybody knows that Doc's MP5 is significantly better than Rook's MP5. Like, is this really even... Are we being serious right now? All right. Next up is Fuse. Let's put Fuse in B tier. He's pretty good. You can't go wrong with Fuse. Glaz. Man, where should I put Glaz, bro? I'm trying to think, like, you could really you could really get active with Glaz with the smoke grenades, right? You can really hit the finesse. But I think with all the people playing Warden, he's not that good. We'll, we'll put Glaz in D tier, okay? Tachanka. Tachanka. Didn't they recently change Tachanka? I thought I read something in the patch notes that they're like adding a 1.5 to his gun or taking it away or something. I have no idea. Regardless though, I mean, we all know the Chonka is the goat, right? All the way to S tier, okay? Here comes Smoke. Similar operator, really. They're both kind of used for plant denial or like area denial. Smoke, I mean, he's pretty good. Um, let's see, where should we put Smoke? I think, yeah, I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think. I mean, honestly, bro, who's playing for the team? We're going to D tier. Come on, guys. We all know that Solus is better. The only reason you guys are playing smoke is for the shotgun and the SMG. Quit trolling. You guys aren't even placing your shield anyway. When I play Oregon downstairs and we never have a smoke. Or when we do, he doesn't play bunker. So what's the point of it? Put him in D tier. Everybody knows Solus is the new smoke at S tier. The shotgun, the SMG combo can't get better than that. You know, I know you've got that combo with Mute, but he's a one speed now. Who wants a one speed? I want a two speed minimum, okay? Capkin, okay, dude. Capkin's A tier. Let's be honest, guys. Capkin is the GOAT. Can't go wrong with Capkin. Blitz, yeah, bro. Blitz is S tier. I mean, you guys just haven't seen my Blitz videos. I don't know if you guys saw. I used to be the best Blitz in NA, bro. I'm just going to say it right now. I used to be the be best Blitz in NA. Blitz is, Blitz is definitely S tier. Let's see. IQ, I mean, it's basically Solus on attack. I mean... I don't know if I like I don't know if I like the guns on IQ as much as I like the guns on Solus. So IQ's gonna go A tier. I mean this is really this this tier list so far is really filling out. I think we're a little bit bottom heavy. Let's try to get more operators in the S tier. Let's see, bandit, bro. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Who really bandit tricks nowadays, guys? No one's bandit tricking. Why why are you even playing bandit, bro? That's on F tier. Jaeger. I mean, like, yeah, you don't want to get naded, but dude. Me personally, when I, when someone throws a nade at me, I just run away from it. So like the nades don't even blow me up. So I'm gonna put him in like C tier. He's okay. Like yeah, Yaker's fine. But you know, to be honest, like I just run for the nades. They can't even nade me anyways, cause I cause I'm on a three speed, right? Or I'm on at least a two speed. I'm playing Solus instead of Smoke, so I can run away from the grenades. So you know, who needs Jaeger when I'm quick on my feet? Let's see, Buck. I mean, Buck's cool. 
You know, I don't know. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. The C8 is really nice, right? The C8, the shotgun combo, it's really cool. You got the hard breach gadget. You can get a lot done with Buck. He's an okay operator. Let's put him in like C tier. You know, let's put him C tier. Frost. Hold on a minute, guys. Hold on a minute. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. It's gonna be controversial, okay? People either think that Frost is S tier or F tier, okay? I'm trying to think of where I want to put Frost right now. I think I'm gonna put Frost. Let's see. Honestly, bro, like you're never catching me in a Frost mat all the way to F tier. I've never even Frost matted before, so. Let's see, Blackbeard, dude. If you play Blackbeard, come on, guys. If you guys play Blackbeard, you're just you're just wanting to win. You just want to win more than other people. Simple as that. Don't take any hate that you get in the all chat when you play Blackbeard. Every time you play Blackbeard, I know people instantly go in the all chat and like, dude, why are you on Blackbeard, bro? You're just trying to win. You're getting your elo. They're not about it as much as you are. Simple as that. Next up, we got Valkyrie. I mean, Valk's okay, but she's banned like every round. You can't even play her, bro. Valk's F tier. She's banned every round. How could I play her? I know she's a good opera. How do I play her? She's banned. F tier. Capital, I mean, you know, Wamai is like the only counter to the Capital bolts, you know, Jaeger doesn't really stop it, but, you know, he's got the eye patch, he can't even see out of one of his eyes, guys, F tier, come on, I don't want, I, I don't want to be blind in one eye, are you kidding me, Cav, everybody knows Cav is S tier, I mean, this is just common knowledge, I think everybody knows that at this point, literal wall hacks, are you kidding me, the most OP thing I've ever seen in my life, Habana, you know, she's okay, you know, you can get some walls open or whatever, but like, we already discussed, Guys, we're not getting walls open. We're Amaroing into sight, okay? We are Amaroing into sight. Who needs Havana? You've got the secondary hard breach gadget. You can do whatever you want to do. Echo, listen, Echo is a great operator, right? We're putting Echo in B tier. Simple as that. Jackal, let's see. Jackal's always banned, bro. You've got to get him in, you've got to put him in F tier. He's always banned. Once again, it's the same thing as Valk. Yeah, he's, he's, he's good, but I can't play him. Same thing with Mira, bro. F tier. These operators suck, man. They're always banned. Yang, though, on the other hand... Bro, did you guys know I actually used to be the best Ying in NA? This this is crazy. I was a Ying main back in the day. I'm, I'm putting Ying all the way in A tier. Ying is amazing. Legion, dude, ah, man, every time I see people play Legion, you guys aren't even placing the traps, man. You guys are just using Legion for the T5. Come on. All the way in D tier. If you guys are just going to use Legion for the T5, just play Oryx, guys. Come on. Just play Oryx. Moving on, Sophia, you know, she's got the stuns, she's got the breaches, she's got a decent amount of utility, her gun's okay, you know, we'll put her in E tier, I think that's fair. Now, Ella, bro, obviously S tier, no counter to the gadget, great gun, the compositor change is great, bro, you guys already know, Ella is it in S tier. Dokubi, yeah, I mean, we're gonna put her in C tier, bro, she's kind of annoying, so I'm gonna put, uh, she, you know, she's actually so annoying, I'm gonna bump her down to D tier just to piss her off. Moving on to Vigil, I mean, like, he's good, but like... <sighs> Bro, are you guys still playing Vigil in 2023? Are you guys serious? Bro, until until they bring the SMG-12 back to what it was in Operation White Noise, don't even talk about Vigil, guys. Put him all the way in F tier. What's he bringing for the team? He's honestly just useless. I, I can't believe anyone's even on Vigil. Comment down below if you still play Vigil. There's no way. There's no way you're still on Vigil, right? All right, moving on to Line. I mean, let's think here. Line, you just hit a button. You scan. Everybody has to stop moving. I mean, it sounds kind of cool. We'll, we'll, we'll put him in C tier. You know, we'll bump him up the beats here actually he's got a decent weapon we'll bump him up have you ever wanted to play siege with and learn from your favorite pro players and content creators well fortunately for you athena and i just started six shot academy a community project aimed at helping you improve at siege we do nightly tms ranked games vod review coaching and so much more on our discord server we also asked your favorite pro players to help us create the best learning resource in siege with their help, we created countless videos for you to binge and take your game to the next level. So if you're serious about improving at Siege, consider joining the only place where you can learn straight from your favorite players. Check out Six Shot Academy with the link below. Finca, I mean, dude, I think just because of the LMG meta, Finca needs to go to F tier. I know that I know the LMG meta is gone, but dude, the LMG meta was so bad that she needs to be punished for that, bro. All the way down to F tier. She's the one that started it with that stupid LMG. The pain I had to go through, F tier, bro. Are you kidding me? Alibi, next up. Let's see. Dude, I know you guys are always going crazy for Alibi, but I don't think she's that good, bro. She lost the 1.5. She's got a Bailiff. That's cool. She's got a shield. She's got impacts. That's cool. Yeah, C tier. Maestro, let's think. You got you got the camps to deny. You got the impacts. I mean, Maestro's S tier, guys. Come on. Maestro's S tier. Maverick. Uh, we talked about hard breaches, guys. Mav has no counter. He's better than Habana, better than Thermite. We'll put him in C tier just because he's got no counters. The Clash, obviously S tier. Tell me how you're going to counter the Clash right now. Tell me how you're going to counter the Clash. How are you going to do it? You're not. Simple as that. Nomad, dude, listen. Who needs to watch flanks if you're in sight with Amaru in 15 seconds? There's no flank to watch. I've killed the whole team. Amaru, or, uh, or Nomad. 
Ah, uh, D tier, I think that's probably fine. Cade, I mean, you can stop the wall, but listen, guys, we already discussed. There's no, we're not getting the wall here. We're going straight in. So I think Cade, you know, we'll put him in E tier. I think that's fine. You know, there's a place for him, but you know, when I'm playing the game, I'm in sight. So it really don't matter to me. Let's see, Gridlock. Once again, guys, what, what, what kind of flank are we watching right now? I'm in sight all the way on E tier. Mozzie, hmm, Roni. Mm, this is a, this is a tough one guys this is a tough one we'll put mozzie in b tier we'll put mozzie in b tier knock bro we got to put knock in s tier same as cav they're basically the same operator almost we'll just put them in s tier uh warden dude warden's also s tier you counter the glass obviously you need warden goyo yeah he's, he's got the traps but listen i'm tired of playing goyo in ranked you you, you guys want to know why i'm tired of playing goyo in ranked because every time i play goyo in ranked nobody shoots the traps nobody shoots them so you know what goyo d tier d tier because no one shoots the traps. What's the point of me picking Goyo if no one shoots the traps? You guys know I always complain about this on stream, right? You guys know this is a real thing. He's in D tier. Cali, I mean, you've got a one-shot weapon. Does it really get much better than that? I think we'll probably put it above D tier in C. Just above the glass. A little bit better than the glass, Cali is, I think. Well, my... I mean, listen, guys. Once again, I'm just straight running from the grenades. Uh, well, mine's cool. You really only counter Capital. Like, I understand you can you can stop nades or whatever, but like, let's be honest, guys. Just run from the nades. Be quick on your feet. Hit the cardio. Just run away from it. Let's see. Iana. I mean, Iana's cool. You've got the drones. you got infinite drone utility. But let's be honest, guys. We're not even playing Iana. We're on Amaru. But if you are going to play Iana for the guns, I, I guess. I guess. You know, we'll, we'll put a B tier. We'll put a B tier. You really shouldn't be drawing with the Yana, though. Who's using the utility on Yana? Just use the nades and the gun. Oryx, I mean, dude, clearly Oryx is A tier, bro. Oryx is the GOAT. You guys already know I love Oryx. Ace, guys, come on. We've, we, how many times have we talked about this? We're not opening any walls, bro. D tier. D tier. Above or below Maverick. Above Habana. Simple as that. Let's see. Malusi. Oh, man, they they nerfed Malusi into the ground, bro. They, they nerfed Malusi into the ground, bro. We got to put her in F tier. Come on, they ruined Malusi, guys. No C4. Took away the uh, the ability to uh, for the, the gadget to be bulletproof. I mean, really not that good anymore. Just kind of useless overall. Who plays Malusi? Why are you on Malusi? Same thing with Zero. Why are you on Zero? Play somebody else. Play somebody else. A Rooney. A Rooney is okay. We'll put a Rooney in B. You know what? We'll put a Rooney in A tier. A Rooney is kind of cool. Okay, we like a Rooney. We'll play it. We'll, we'll put a Rooney in A tier. All right. Flores. Flores is cool, but here's my problem with Flores, guys. Right? You know, I'm playing Flores. You know, I pull out my gadget. I start droning. And then I'm bored because I'm droning. So, you know, E tier. I mean, like, it's kind of cool. The drone blows up. It's kind of a unique mechanic compared to the other drones. But listen, I get so bored. Five seconds in. By the time my operator has put the drone on the ground, I'm like, dude, this is boring. I got to be in sight. Back onto Amaru. Next up, Thunderbird. You know, we do love the infinite heals. Thunderbird's got to go into S tier. Has to go S tier, bro. The C4, the heals. We love Thunderbird. Osa, S tier. You guys know I love Osa. S tier. Thorn, S tier. Have you guys not seen my Thorn Spa on Villa? Makes your S tier just for that. Next up, Azami, S tier. S tier. Sens, F tier. Who is using Sens? Who? Why are you using Sens? Finally, Grim, F tier. Let me know what you guys think of my awesome Operation Commanding Force Rainbow Six Siege tier list. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. If you guys enjoyed this video, consider liking, consider subscribing, turn on notifications for more videos like this one. Comment down below, guys. Let me know your thoughts. Yo, follow the link in the description if you want to make your own Operator tier list. I'll review them on stream possibly, and I'll compare. I'll give you my thoughts on it, but this is my Rainbow Six Siege tier list. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, remember, subscribe, like, all that good stuff, but I will see you guys in the next one.